I am Sue Tap Tap, and let's play Duck Game. Great music on the title screen here, but it's a little bit loud. So here's our main menu here. And I like how the main menu is done. You can jump in the airlock to do your, uh, you know, to quit the game. There's a level editor. Um, I'm not actually sure what the library is. It's a bunch of me's. Oh, it's your stats. That makes sense. Alright. The focus of the game is multiplayer, and I'm not going to show off multiplayer, because I usually don't. Um, but... Alright, this is the options. So I, You know what's weird? Okay, so I prefer to play games on full screen windowed. This has nothing to do with the game. Um, and for some reason, some games full screen windowed just amazingly well. I use this app called Borderless Gaming. And this game happens to do that amazingly well. I'm very glad about that. But some games don't, and it just doesn't... I don't know. I don't know, man. But, like, with this game, if I press, um... Like, if I use borderless gaming, it just squishes up and fills my screen and is just beautiful and perfect. And I'm glad for that. But yes, um... So, yeah, you can... Like, play local co-op or, like... Kill each other, I guess. Um, I'm gonna play the arcade though, not online. <laughs> um, I've heard that the online's very fun for what it's worth, but yeah, we're just gonna check out the arcade stuff. Oh, right, I have tickets now. Some hats. I don't need hats. Gameplay modifier. Sure. Oh, cool. So you can buy cheat codes. That's cool. What's this one? Ah! Whatever. We'll just get those two. So now we can jump higher. Alright, so the variety zone gives us some different <coughs> goals we can do here. And it's a cool it's a cool enough little showing of how you can what you can do in the game. So this little uh obstacle course here. I think it's pretty interesting. You, um... So there's basic moving and jumping, but you can also uh, press down to break through glass. Oops. Well, that murdered our time. We're making decent time, otherwise. <laughs> I love the quack, the quacking. See, so it certainly could have been much better. So let's learn how to use a death ray, shall we? I remember being terrible at this one. Ugh. Oh, and if you press the B button, you quack. That's all it does. I don't actually like this level. So let's quit! Yes! Really? No! Yes! Yes. No. Oh, and the, the, it has like a rope mechanic that is like... kind of hard to use. So let's check out some levels I haven't done that. Aw. I guess we have an unlock mechanic here. And the quacking is animated. So I mean, why wouldn't it be? And this, just in general, this game is stupid in the absolute best way. Let's choose a hat. I love how he slips into the hats. Like, it's way cooler than just having the hat appear on him. Let's be a drunk. You can have different profiles if you really want to. Oh, um... This game is published by Adult Swim Games, and they um, they give me a free review copy of this game. And I just wanted to say, um, Adult Swim, like, they always did, um, not always, but for a long time, they did cool Flash games. <laughs> you rev up the chainsaw, that's excellent. Um, what? 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 <laughs> that is amazing! That's the best thing I ever saw. Uh, that was so awesome I lost my train of thought. Oh, yes, Adult Swim Games. They um, they started publishing um, games on Steam and stuff, and like, you know, funding indie games that like... Like, they've just been functioning as a general, you know, indie publisher, and that's pretty cool of them. And their games have been pretty cool. They've been... Um, 
not entirely predictable Adult Swim fare. Like, this game, I would say, is predictable Adult Swim fare, and I mean that in a loving way. Uh, but there was also, like, Oblitus, which, uh, interesting idea, didn't like that game very much, honestly. Um, it was a very unforgiving little thing. And, uh... I'm guessing there was a way I was supposed to jump straight for that. No! I love the chainsaw courses, by the way. This is just excellent. I love the quacking when you win. Chainsaw racing is just... the best sport I've ever heard of. <laughs> Did you climb up walls this way, too? I, I want to see someone that knows what they're doing play this with the chainsaw racing. Because this is awesome, I don't know what I'm doing at all. Oh god, laps? Is laps now? Okay, hang on. No. Why did this work the first time? Why am I having problems? Why? Okay. Rude. Not sure what I did wrong. I think I was supposed to unlock that thing. That shortcut. Huh. Wait. Well, let's quit and see if we've unlocked any different arcade cabinets. Aw. I did before. You start with only like two arcade cabinets and then uh... And you win some levels, you, uh... I'm not really sure how the unlocking works. Well, let's show these off. I was terrible with these, but... Alright. So it's like way harder version of, um... Worms, uh, Ninja Rope. Fortunately, there doesn't seem to be a minimum height you have to jump to hurt anything. All right, we're doing way better than I was when I was practicing, so I have to... Now that's... that's more like what I was like when I was practicing. I don't suppose I unlocked a new arcade machine? No? Nobody? Nothing? Alright. Let's show you these obstacle or not obstacle forces. The target missions. Yeah. Pick it up. Ugh. I don't like that you have to pick up the guns. Alright, let's let's Also I like that the restart is quick. <clears throat> also certain weapons you have to cock um, after shooting, which is pretty cool. I'm not really used to it, so it took me by surprise. And also, weapons have limited ammo. Ah. Not entirely sure what a good way to tell how much ammo a weapon has. Like, there's a shotgun that clearly shows you. Um, the gun, like, starts smoking once you've exhausted your ammo. Like that. So it's easy to tell when you're out of ammo, not always as easy to tell when you're getting low, but not out. Also, I love the shooting the water thing and having crap come out of it. Excellent little touch. I'm not entirely sure what the trick is to, uh, break. But I love the music. Ah. Crap. 
just in general, the game is the exact right amount of dumb fun, both in terms of its humor and just actual gameplay. Um, ah. I guess I should play online. Um, you know what? I'll try. I'll do a round, just for the purpose of showing it off. I generally strongly dislike um, playing crap online, but uh, this game will make an exception. Excuse me. You have to grab and then equip. Eh? Was I supposed to kill everybody? I thought I was just supposed to get the intel and flee. I guess I was supposed to kill everybody. Oh! Ah oh, man, I'm stupid. Maybe I could have gotten silver if I did that right. Let's show you this last mission, then we'll try a round of multiplayer. Just once, though, and just because I love you guys. And these shoes let you stomp people, which is pretty nice. This is the shotgun I was talking about. They also let you walk on spikes. Um. Um. Crap. Oh. Let's grab my shotgun back. I just wasted so much time, I'm terrible. Alright. The minigun slows you down and has a wind-up. I really love when there's little touches like that. It makes it feel a lot more satisfying. <laughs> ah. We're terrible at video games. I'm sorry. I failed you all. No. Yes, really. Ugh. Need to calm down a bit there. Let's play some online real quick here. And I like how the character select teaches you the game's controls, like super basically. I don't care. Connected to Moon. Searching even harder. Hmm. Seven open games. <coughs> Excellent music. I don't... I don't really care, so... We got some minor lag on the bottom left here, just slightly. Sure, it <laughs> won't be a problem. Break glass in case of war, I just noticed that. Oh my god, you can quack. I just picked up a desk! A plus. Ah! I have terrible reaction times, I'm sorry. I can't quack while I'm dead. <laughs> the quack button is the best. Oh god, which one am I? Okay. What? I don't like that gun. Well then. Come on, kill each other. Oh, come on, guys. There you go. Nice! That was honestly panicking there, but it worked. Okay. I'm not used to how the game decides to do the... What? Grenades? Okay. Okay. 
I play the best when I just randomly panic. That's excellent. Aw. Oh. That wasn't panicking enough. That was that's clearly the problem here. Okay, this is pretty fun, even if I'm terrible. Why did I throw my gun? Nice. <laughs> okay, the online is fun. I'll admit it. I still won't play it very much, though. Huh? What? I have no idea what's going on in most of these... Maps. I love how fast the round changes are, though. What? Oh god. I'm on fire. <laughs> you turn into roast duck. Here, chicken. Duck. Yes, actually, duck. Never mind. the hat and wink. That was amazing. Aww. At least I gotta wear a cool hat before I died. I like how fast the multiplayer switching is. That was the one thing I really liked in the Splatoon uh, test fire. Was matchmaking was pretty quick and uh, rounds were pretty quick and so you had minimal downtime. I'm just really not a fan of the... What? Huh? I have no idea if we're even controlling that. I just pressed buttons and things happened. Oh. No, it's just- it's how many th people you've killed. <laughs> Crap. I don't know how to grenade. I killed somebody at least, though. Right, uh, I'm not sure when the round actually ends, but I guess we'll call it quits then. Come on, guys. It's always these two that are, like, jerking around here. Pfft. Come on, guys. Oh, for Pete's sake. Bouncy grenades. Well, crap. I am morally obligated to complain that some of th that some of the effects have different pixel sizes. The game generally looks pretty good, but uh... ah, come on. And the scaling isn't too bad. Scaling is kind of always a little bad, but uh, it's not too disruptive. I've definitely seen a lot worse. Well, shit. Put me out! Put me out! I'm out! Why am I on fire now? No! I was out! Crap. <laughs> I love that that happens. Oh my god! This is the best. I do hope you two kill each other, though. These guys must be friends or something, because it's always these two. Come on, guys, kill each other. Surely there's some sort of timed thingy that eventually kills you. Nice. Well. Come on! 
That was so close. Nice. Aww. I probably should have gone for the gun. <laughs> that was pretty nice. Alright. What am I supposed to do? This gun sucks, I hate it. Alright. Oh god. Oh god. Oh crap. I had the gun. Eh. the worst gun ever. Not that I got to use it. Alright. Oh. Oh my god. Laser guns. Rude. get a single... Eh. Unsurprisingly, I'm not very great at it. Ah, two! Can I... I think I'm gonna have to abort here. I figured it would eventually end. Whatever. That is Duck Game! It is pretty ridiculous.